Holy crap, that load time was fast. Um... Okay. Um, uh, wow. Anywho, hello, ladies and gentle beans, and welcome to another exciting episode of Let's Play Dead Space. I'm Gamma, and in the previous episode, we were traipsing around the medical facilities. We were trying to find the captain of the ship who was apparently dead, because even though he was dead, we could still use a piece of authentication that he had to, uh, find out a little bit more about what the fuck went on here and how to get out of here. And in the process, we ended up finding a giant stingray vagina monster that could reanimate the dead, and, uh, to make matters worse, uh, the, the ship is now being pulled into the gravity of the planet that we're orbiting above, so we gotta go and, uh, fix that, and, uh, that's why we're here. So why don't we, uh, get moving? You got two problems, and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. This thing needs a fucking ringtone. <laughs> God damn it. Ugh. Oh yeah, we also picked up this awesome line gun. Okay, so where exactly do we go? We go that way, which means that we go this way, because there might be stuff. No, there's no stuff. Okay. Oh, wait, no, wait, there might be stuff here. Or this just could be the waiting room for the tram. Oh, no, wait, there is stuff here. Somebody thought it would be a good idea to just put plasma cutter energy inside this locker in a waiting room in a transit station. Did somebody... Did, did, did somebody just, like, prepare for this? Was there somebody out there that was like, Our ship is gonna get overrun with zombies one day, man. I'm just gonna hide ammo in random lockers in public areas. Nobody will notice except me. I'm a fucking survivalist. That's probably not what they said, but... Whatever, I'm not gonna argue with plasma energy up the wazoo. Plasma energy is good. Plasma energy makes it so that we die a lot less quickly. I'm actually wondering when I'm going to end up dying, because there's a part of me that does want to show it off at some point, because fuck, man, dead space deaths are violent. Personal log. Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. It's been two days since they pulled that planet open, since the captain died. The panic, the riots, they were nothing compared with what came after. Our friends, our co-workers, started coming back. Changed. Coming back to kill us, drag us away. Rucker disappeared this morning, and I have to assume he's dead. My crew, they're starting to crack. I'm trying to keep an eye on them, but right now I have bigger problems. We're hemorrhaging fuel, and the primary engine is laboring. Danvers and I are going to try to reach the fuel depot to see if we can fix it. Temple out. What the f... Is there something over there? I thought I saw something, like, fly by when I swiveled the camera to look at that little asteroid hologram. That's actually the planet that just has asteroids orbiting around it. Fuck. I love this game's atmosphere. Is that Temple? Is that him? Is that the guy that that, that log came out of? That PA system sounds like the... the... the, the fucking Combine announcer lady in Half-Life 2. That was probably what they were going for. Anywho, well, actually... How are we looking for, uh, funds? Mm, we've only got like, a uh, thousand six hundred creds. We can't really do much with that. Ah, uh, well. There's plenty that we can do. Until then, like murder thi- oh. Okay. Are you gonna come up and- are you gonna pop up? Are you gonna- Yep, yep! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Asshole. It doesn't always happen, but when it does, it's nice to be prepared. It's nice to not have a complete panic attack. Ooh, text logs. Just let this scroll real quick so y'all can read it. <laughs> this guy doesn't know what's going on around here. Uh. If there is one argument for, uh, 
HD monitors and stuff like that. It is how small the text continuously gets in these games. You cannot play this in 480p. I tried once before. It did not go very well. Everything was very, 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 very difficult to read. Uh, also, I'm pretty... I could have sworn I upgraded this thing. What the fuck? Uh... Oh, wait, that's the line gun. I want to upgrade my plasma cutter, yo. I want to up that thing's damage a little bit. Uh, except I can't because there's no line connecting those two nodes. God damn it. Hmm. I could always upgrade its capacity, or I could upgrade the reload time. I'll upgrade the reload time. And, of course, I'm going to keep a spare node just in case we find a power lock, because power locks are good. Why some power lock a transformer? Oh no, I, th I might be thinking of power glide. Yeah, whatever. Anywho, this line got fuck. I need to stop doing. I I Whoa. <laughs> I need to stop doing that. I keep accidentally stasising when I mean to reload things. Except it's all that big. Made that ragdoll look kind of funny. Whoa. Okay, he's under the grating. Good. That's all I need. Emergency supplies. Now, this makes a little bit more sense. First aid kits. Those are things that anyone could use. I mean, again, I'm not going to argue with plasma energy, but at the same time, who besides a miner would need a plasma energy clip in some dude's locker in a fucking... Hey. I heard that. I heard that. The... Fuck are you, you son of a dead person? Oh, daughter. I realize that there are both men and women on the ship. It's generally how this works. Ooh, an Xbox! I'm gonna break it! Line gun! Actually, how am I looking for. Oh, I've actually got a rather. Uh, a reasonable supply of ammo. What do you say? What are you saying there, buddy? Authorized technicians only. Severe risk of injury or death. That sounds like this entire ship. This entire ship is one big liability. Oh! Nope. Heart this line gun so much. Elevator! Malfunction! Kinesis required. Alright. Sure. Look at me. I'm a badass. Hmm. Now, if I remember right, one of these elevator rides provides a challenge form of those stupid babies. It's really foggy in here. It's smoky or something. The fuck was that? Um. Um. Nothing showing up. Oh, something is showing up. Knock you out preemptively. Oh. Oh no, that was actually... Oh, no, 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 no. No ammo. No ammo. Switch to the plasma cutter, buddy. Thank you. Reload, reload, reload! Oh god! Oh god! I'm getting nommed on. I'm getting nommed on. No, 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 no. Asshole, go away. 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 Oh god. Oh god! Fucking reload you full! Okay, come on, cut his arms off. Drop him. Ah. Uh, okay. I think it's safe to say that these guys are sufficiently dead. And we got some health! Yum yum. <laughs> use the health pack, Isaac. Don't swing it around and then use it. That's not very professional or safe. You could break it and then you would be really dead because you wouldn't have it anymore, even though we've got a bigger one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we got a bigger one. And we got an air can. 
forgot we got an air can. Also, somebody is screaming off in the distance. Why couldn't this place be a vacation ship? They have no business going around cracking planets and disturbing the natural balance of things. That's what I imagine is going on, right? Money, money! I broke an Xbox and I got money. Uh... What are you telling me to do? Oh, I gotta go over here now? Elevator rides! More elevator rides! That's all everyone ever... That's all everyone ever wanted. Now, how do I go on and... Go on and turn you on? Or do I have to kinesis you again? What are you doing here? North... Uh, North Refueling Control Station. Hmm. Supposed to go over there. But... This panel doesn't seem to want to do anything. Do I just have to get the bodies out of here? I'm a little confused. Um... Oh, power node! Yes! I won't argue with that. Base to explore. Okay, so my little waypoint line was just getting really, really confused. I went that way. Unfortunately, this game does have that issue where... No, wait. No, I am supposed to go here. What the fuck? Um... Um... Well, at least I got a thing. So... Actually, is that another thing over there? I thought I saw a glow. No. No. We're j okay. Whoa. So that thing just isn't updating, and it's telling me to go back the way that I came. Okay. So, I basically just wasted a shit ton of time there. Oh well. Whatever. Let's keep on exploring. There is a thing over there. There's a save point. Sure. We'll save. We'll save ever so quickly. Saving is a good thing. Saving is a highly advised thing to do. Never know when something could happen. All right. Ooh, the Ripper schematic. Oh, yes, yes, please. All right, here we go. Pull down. Refueling sequence activated. That did a good thing. That was a good thing. Oh. Babies, babies. Oh, the, kick the baby. Kick the baby. Uh. Oh. those things? How can these things shoot those? Those weird spinny darts? Do they spin? It sounds like they spin. Too bad uh, the line gun doesn't have the vertical uh, slice. I mean, you can give it that in Dead Space 3, but that's two whole games from now. There's no time for that shit. Alright, so now I think I can go back into that elevator. I don't know why I thought I had to go back there. Oh well. That's just what happens when everything on the ship looks kind of the same. Do I have a stasis recharge? No, I do not. I do have a semicon- No, no, that was a, that was a schematic, not a semiconductor. Doop. Alright, there we go. Now it works. Is that thing gonna roar at us again? That thing is probably gonna roar at us again, isn't it? Yep, there it is. Why the hell is it roaring at us? What even is it? Anybody home? Anybody home? No? No? Okay. I'm going away then. Gonna just open this, this locker up. And then I'm just gonna... 
Make my way down. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, God, no, not the fucking parasites. I don't have an efficient means of dealing with you things yet. So... Urgh. Ah! Fuck! There we go. Uh, fortunately, the schematic that we picked up does allow us a means of fucking them up later, but we'll get to that when we uh, when we actually, you know, get to it. Anywho, activated sufficient fuel to fire primary engine. Whatever you did, it's working, Isaac. I have a fuel reading. It's only a quarter full, but that's enough to restore orbit once you bring the engines online. What the hell? Oh, false alarm. I thought I saw something. So, how come sometimes you decide to come on in, uh, in, in jump scare video form, and other times you just decide to go audio only? Make up your goddamn mind, Hammond. Uh-oh. Oh, no, 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 We are not doing this. Get the fuck off. I don't want it. Okay. What the hell? That was a really weak punch. Oh god! Oh god. The camera angle is so awkward. There we go. There we go. That's right. Now we actually fucked up. Oh! Well, that happened. Well, there we go. We got- we got killed. That is a dead space death. It is not a proper dead space death unless you are in at least five different pieces, I would say. So, all things considered, I'd say that it was a, you know, a fairly, a uh, fairly decent introductory death. Yes, yes, we heard you the first time, Hammond. Alright, so now that I know that that's gonna happen, I gotta hurry the fuck up and get there before he reanimates that guy. Okay, and then I got stuck on geometry, so it's gonna happen anyway. Stasis, stasis, you fool. No, or I can just use my health because... I probably should have done that anyway. There we go. Murder that thing. No, no, stasis. There we go. Switch to my cutter. Slice this dude up. My god, that is a lot of blood. That is like no more heroes levels of blood. Yeah, what did I just pick up there? I think I picked up uh, another air can. Okay. Hey, we'll deal with air cans. I feel like there is still something around here because the music is still being all scary. Did I not raid these lo- oh no, I did raid these lockers. How much more money do I have now? Ooh, I've got... 11,000. Why don't we go and, uh, deposit our new schematic and see if we can afford, uh, the weapon in question. Schematic downloaded the Ripper! We do have enough ammo, f uh, enough money for it. Fuck yes! I love this weapon so fucking much. Hmm, we can also buy the- no, we already have the level 2 suit. Um... Anything that we can sell? Nothing really worth selling. Oh, hey, the music came back after we left the store. That was convenient. So, we don't have any ammo for... Oh, wait, we do have ammo for it. This here is the Ripper. And if I'm lucky, we'll be able to show off what this beautiful little contraption does in a second. Because I know that there's going to be a monster lurking around somewhere. Mmm, health. I do like health. Uh, I don't need to go back to the train. I need to get back out there so I can turn the engine back on. That's what I gotta do. Mm hmm. This away. Oop, but first, gotta raid the fridge. Even though that's absolutely not a fridge. Ah, elevators. I really want to play System Shock now. One of these days, I'll do that! I think I bring it up at least once in most videos now. Well, in most playthroughs, I should say. Hmm. 
Here we go. What do we got here? Warning! Mandatory decontamination. The gravity centrifuge is really hard to read because that shit's all cracked up and flashing. Fuck it. Safety be damned. Nobody follows safety codes. Otherwise, we wouldn't have hostile aliens all over the ship, probably. Hmm, blue thing. What are you? You are... As soon as my thing decides to register you, you're an air... You're a small air, air can. Getting a lot of air cans. That might be a little ominous. Are we gonna get sucked into space? I hope not. What's this guy saying? This is Temple. Now the centrifuge is offline. We've got four trillion tons of rock hanging off our ass, and without that centrifuge to balance the ship, the gravity tethers will pull us straight down to the colony. I'm heading in there now to see if I can fix it. Why did he just leave a diary in a locker? Was that his locker? I thought he was in that room where we found the first log that he... I don't know. The whole audio diary trope is cool, but at the same time, it sometimes doesn't make sense because you wonder why the fuck they left these things in, like, the specific places that they left them. It's, it's weird. What is in here, I wonder? Ooh. The, uh, the, uh, the decon system. Okay. Uh-oh. Decontamination! And of course... Oh... Is this the one- is this the sequence that I- that I think it is? It's actually kind of hard because everyone just kind of comes out of the woodwork. Yep. Well, at least I can show this thing off. Come on, come out here. You want it- you want to come in here. You want to come into this place even though it's completely... ...avoiding the entire point of the decontamination shower. There you are. Eat Ripper! And that's the Rippers, ladies and gentle beans. It is one of the coolest weapons in the entire game. It is just a giant fucking buzzsaw that rips everything in half. Hence the name Ripper. The sound that this thing makes is also one of the most satisfying things ever. Fuck the Doom Chainsaw. I have the Dead Space Ripper. Uh, oh, hi! Yeah, it's alternate fire isn't nearly as fun. It's probably really powerful as fuck, but... Why, why, why shoot a... Why shoot a buzzsaw at long range when you can get up close and personal and just slice the, the fucker to bits? You might want to run... I want to run, run that decontamination sequence again, considering that uh, there's a lot more blood here now. A lot more alien monster human blood. Whatever, I guess. Yeah. The whole decontamination thing doesn't exactly get old anytime soon. Actually, I want to say it was a little bit worse in 2. Actually, forget it. It's been so long since I've played 2. Actually, no. The last time I played through these games was was shortly before 3 came out. So, yeah, no, that would be a while ago. That was back in 2013. So... Whatever. I gotta just keep running. Ooh, goodies. What kind of goodies do we have here? We got a semiconductor. A gold semiconductor. I like it. Ooh. And pulse rounds. The hell do we need pulse rounds for? We don't have any pulse weaponry. Probably could have jacked one of those rifles from, uh, from our dead crew member who had a fucking gun for some reason, even though we didn't. A repair team, not a security detail. I think we should all get a weapon if that's the case, just in case. Medium air can. Getting a lot of air cans. I don't like the look of this. Actually, what the heck? Hmm. Well, we'll see what, we'll see what... Zero gravity. Ooh. Okay, yeah, so centrifuge access. That would make sense. Gravity. Entering zero gravity. Gotta activate this thing so that we can uh, get back to orbiting the planet. Gotta remember that we can jump. Mm -hmm. We 
don't need you ruining my day. Hey! I was busy ripping him. Ow! Fine. Fine, we'll do this in, we'll do this the traditional way then. If this is indeed the way that you want to play. How come you're able to cling to the ground so easily? Are your claws like digging into the into the floor? Is that why you're able to crawl around even though there is no gravity? I mean we've got an excuse. We've got magnetized boots. I don't know what your deal is. Anywho, line racks floating around in, in, in zero gravity space is always a good thing. So if I remember correctly, what we gotta do is we gotta uh not Yeah, we 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 need to use the stasis, I'm pretty sure, because if we don't then that happens. But we don't have uh, any stasis packs, so there might be a there might be a stasis recharge nearby though. Um, unless our thing decides that it wants to just kind of passively recharge. That's a there's another air can like there's an air can station over there. So something tells me that uh, we're gonna need that air. No clue. Hmm. Hmm. Where is the stupid stasis place? The stasis places. Well, I'll tell you one thing. We've got more line rounds. Can't have too many line rounds. Whose line is this, anyway? Eventually, that joke had to be made. Alright, so... What the fuck? Oh. An Xbox! I hate old Xboxes! We're on the 360, y'all! Usually the stasis likes to refill at this point, so... Um, unless I'm just not seeing where the recharging station is... It actually might be in here. God, that's gotta be the most disorienti disorienting thing ever. Is there no purpose to this room? There is no purpose to this room. Oh wait, there is a purpose to this room. A hey. Please attach generator modules manually, then return to the station. Also, yay, stasis recharge, finally. Alright, so now that we've got that all settled, let's hop onto that wall. Boop! And then hop onto the floor. Whoop. And then we can finally do the thing that we were supposed to do, which is stasis this son of a bitch, and then kinesis it so it connects to this thing. Attached. We do the same thing to this. Puzzles in this game are not complicated at all. Oh, and then... Now that the power generators are properly installed on this thing, we can go back up to that switch, and we can activate it. And everything will be nice and happy and good and also I don't think we've I don't think we've thrown one of these exploding barrels at an enemy yet. So if we can just grab that real quick and what the fuck? Uh oh hi! Okay, that didn't work out as well as I would hope. But that's satisfying. This kinetic force of this thing was so strong that it just sent the thing's torso all the way up there. Let's shoot it for fun. <laughs> <laughs> this game is so sadistically satisfying. It is fucking cathartic. Ah, I love it so much. All right, so why don't we just go back all the way over here? Bruh. And then... Uh, that's right. The room is all the way over here. Yeah, boop. And then... Let's uh, turn this thing on! Oh dear. So, now the gravity's turned on, but the air is off because... That... Oh, it's a Whoa! Gotta be careful of that thing. Centrifuge and gyros are both 100% and stabilized. Whoa! Now get out of there and focus on the engine. I don't know how much time we have left. Just give me a moment. Ugh. 
Yeah, you don't want to get whacked by that thing. That thing will murder you. And hey, air! No. Go, 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 That was good. Hey, the air came back on. Stasis will slow down. Yeah, we're like doing terrible all of a sudden. Yeah, no, you've got to. You gotta, you gotta be really, you gotta huff it as soon as that thing, uh, leaves, otherwise you will get crushed by it, and it is not fun, as you saw there. So just go, 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 go. Centrifuge and gyros are both 100% and stabilized. Now get out of there and focus on the engine. I don't know how much time we have left. Me neither. Oh, I know how much time I have left. I have 40 seconds before I asphyxiate. Ooh, phew. Uh, I know I have air cans. I could use my air cans, but... The thing was right there, man. Go, 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 So many near misses. So many... Oh, God. Man, you can even... You can even feel the Ripper in space. It's a lovely little thing. Why don't we go and use my air can real quick? Makes uh, it makes the same glug 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 noise as the <laughs> as the health packs. Excellent. All right, run, 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 run. Elevator, go up, please, please. Ah, there we go. Now we can just watch this centrifuge just. Fly around everywhere. That we probably shouldn't do that because eventually we will uh, run out of air. So let's just get out of here. Hey, yeah, look at that! More line rounds. What are you doing there, my friend? I don't know, but I'm not gonna, not gonna lie, not gonna complain about that. Ah, here we go. Whoa! What? Oof. Was not polite. Okay, that ain't working. Oof. Oh. That wasn't good. That wasn't good at all. Ew, Brody. It's like monster pus. The blood is one thing, but pus is ugh. All right, what do we got over here? More decontamination nonsense. Yeah, we gotta go through there. So why don't we go and see what's in, what's around here, just in case. Knock something over, I think. Ah, uh, exploration pays indeed. Another power node. And a blocked off room. So how many nodes do I have now? I've got three! Hells yeah! I think I can still hear the centrifuge. Yeah, I can totally still hear the centrifuge spinning over there. Listen. One of the few moments in the entire game where you can just take in the silent atmosphere. Let's listen to the cool humming of our rig display. What the hell did that thing say? Okay, I'm done diddly dallying, di diddly -dallying with that because, uh, I don't know, I just love the atmospheric sounds in this game, and I like the stupid little display sounds. Ah, I'm a dork, I know. Anywho, let's go and take a shower. Eh. 
And of course, we've got more critters to deal with, don't we? Oh, we don't need to do the shower again? Alright, not gonna complain. So, why don't we go and do some more upgrading, y'all? Hmm, yeah, we're starting to get a lot of things that we can, uh, improve. Hmm, as much as I would love to continue working on my cutter, something tells me we should probably, uh, work on the rig a little bit. Why don't we, uh, go on and, uh... Can also work on the Kinesis module and the Stasis mo Wow, the Stasis module's got a bunch of garbage nodes before you can get to anything useful. Fuck off, man. Hmm. I could upgrade the Ripper. So many options. Hmm. I will upgrade the firing speed of the Plasma Cutter, and then I will go to my rig and I will... Start my journey towards upgrading the HP of this thing. And I will, of course, save my last node for when and if we run into a power locked room. Because sometimes you find nodes in there, and it just never hurts to have the extra equipment. I know some people would probably think it's kind of a useless thing, but I like being a little prudent when it comes to the collecting of goodies in a game where things can become a little bit more scarce. Fuck off. Well, you can already see the difference that this thing had, uh, how, how difference the speed upgrade made. Oof, fuck me. All right. Kinda wish I didn't call that one Metroid Prime. Oop. Can you hear me? It's Kendra. They attacked me. I ran for it, and Hammond just—he just disappeared. Kendra, where are you? Nice to see you're alive and well, Hammond. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them moving outside, but I don't think they know I'm in here. I can launch into everything from here. I hacked the route and found some reports from the colony. Even before they cracked the planet, the colonists were experiencing widespread dementia. It seems to be related to some artifact they found on the planet. Something called the Marker. I'll keep looking. I've got your location and I'm going to unlock the door to fuel storage. You can get to the engine chamber from there. Well... Uh... That's nice, Kendra, you weird lady. What do you mean? The the marker? Somebody somebody's drawing? I don't know. Either way, let's go and sell that gold semiconductor real quick. Since we're here, you know. Seems like a decent thing to do. Mm, as soon as I remember where I put it. There you are, gold semiconductor. You're not nearly as good as a ruby semiconductor, but uh you're still worth something. Ooh, I can almost I can almost afford another node if I really wanted to. Either way, I believe I'm going to save some money. But yeah, before I was really interrupted, I was gonna say I kinda wish that I uh didn't call my one Metroid Prime video the gravity of the situation, because I feel like that would be a little bit more fitting here, but whatever, I don't feel like recycling titles. Anywho. Let's what that? Oh, more vacuuming nonsense. Ooh. Entering zero gravity. Oh. Oh. All right. Um. Well, we do have Xboxes even in space. Even even outside of the ship, we've got Xboxes. That is one pretty view of the planet, though. That's one thing for sure. All right, I should probably stop. Probably stop uh, admiring the scenery. I will run out of air after all. Uh, where the hell is this thing pointing me towards? You're probably pointing me towards that room. 
with this guy. Hang on, hang on. Let me just. Mmm, that's some good O2. All right. Let me shoot you in the tail, buddy. A tail is not something that a human should have. I mean, I know you're not a human anymore, but fuck it, man. That shit's just not in style right now. All right. There's a thing I can probably interact with here. Oh, no, yeah, just keep walking. Walk into the... Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um. Um. <laughs> okay, good. I thought I was gonna have to waste an air tank there for a second. That was really close. Oh, God, this room is loud. <laughs> Pack. What the hell even happened? Oh god, what? The flickering lights and shadows are not very, very, uh... Comforting. I'm just going to leave that room and hopefully never have to come back, except we probably will, because that's how we probably get- What the fuck is going on with the walls? Oh, what the fuck is going on with this dude? I don't think he likes that light. There, what the hell? There's like stuff coming out of him. Ugh. Um. Let's never speak of this again. I know I've been saying that a lot, but okay. Also, this weird goop makes you walk slowly. That's always nice. What is even in here? Ooh, lots of stuff is in here. This is Temple. Screw the engine. I can't restart it by myself. And with all the other shit going on, it's obvious this is sabotage. I'm heading for the bridge, and then I need to find Elizabeth. I gotta get her off this ship. It's not safe. Elizabeth? Elizabeth! I don't even think that voice is speaking in English anymore. I think it might be possessed by whatever... Whatever force hijacked the ship and made everyone go crazy. Okay... Is that... Bone? Ugh... The hell is with all this growth on the wall, man? Whoa. Um. Uh, oh god, parasites, 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 parasites. Oh, no, 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 no. I do have a bit of a fix for you. For you, for, for you, vermin. No. 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 Okay. He probably wasn't actually alive at all, but whatever. It succeeded in freaking me out a little bit. Uh, why don't we just finish this already? Feel like I've been here for a while. Ugh. This goop is gnarly. And I just keep not going in there properly. Alright. What the fuck? Oh! The elevator. Of course! It all makes sense now! Alright, let's, uh, get going. Ooh, yep, power lock. Yay, all! Show me the goodies. We've got ourselves some credits. We've got a schematic for a Ripper Blade. We've got health. We've got a pack of Ripper Blades, we've got more Ripper Blades, and we've got more Ripper Blades. If you are a fan of the Ripper, then this will be your favorite room! It certainly is mine, because I heart this thing. Let's reload. Mmm. Eight of these things. Let's look at... Oh. Oh. So much Ripper. It's ripping time. 
Anybody remember the Ripping Friends? That was a weird show. <laughs> no note, unfortunately, but, uh... Maybe I'm making that whole thing up about how, uh, whoa! <laughs> yeah! That wasn't gonna work very well in your favor. Cause you can't do this! Whoop! Up yours! Alright. Ah, the- one of the- one of the best cures for parasites. A giant, gravity-tethered buzzsaw. I mean, this thing is a pretty good cure for most of these problems, but it's especially great for those small-ass parasites because you can just woo-woo-woo-woo and knock them out. There's a flamethrower that you can get, too, that's uh, just as effective, but this one, I feel, is just a teensy-tiny-whiny little bit more satisfying. We don't need to save. We're okay. Oh. my ripper. Ow. Okay. All right, kids. On the count of... All right, kids. I want you to grab a piece of paper real quick. And after on the count of three, I want you to yell, it's ripping time. And terror. I'm trying to do a bit here, guys. See ya. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. I'm trying to... I'm trying to be funny here, guys. Just... All right. So I'm going to count of three. And then after that, I want you to yell, it's ripping time and tear that piece of paper to bits. One... Two, three, it's ripping time! Aw, oh, yeah! Oh, 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 there we go. Steal my thunder, you sons of bitches! Oh, 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 I gotta be fucking careful with this thing. You do not want to shoot these big fat ones in the stomach. Reasons that I'm pretty sure will uh, become apparent later on because I'm sure I'm gonna do it by accident. But I don't want to do it now. Ugh, phew. These, I believe, are called the pregnant. They have parasites in them. If you rupture their stomach, they will burst out and they will fucking maul you. Yuck. Hey, a power node. Excellent. Nothing else here except for all these corpses. Fuck you, you stupid thing. And there's a button that I can push. Maybe this will turn the engines on. Ignition sequence initiated. Please stand by. Yep, and just like clockwork, more monsters. Really gotta upgrade the damage on this sucker. Because like I said, if you fully upgrade this thing, the Plasma Cutter can basically take on anything. But it's still a little bit awkward. All I've got is a speed upgrade and a small dip. Hey, you guys, stop that. Whoa! Alright, gotta switch to my line. these, like, I know that these are the crew, like the former crew, but what are they all doing with line racks and stuff? Not everybody here could be an engineer, right? Anywho, now that the ignition sequence is, uh, finished, let's light this candle. Engines firing. Objective complete. Objective added leave. That would be my, that would be my best guess. That is one big dangerous, oh, hi. We're online and functional. Finally, some good news. Get a transfer to bridge, Isaac. I'm gonna take us back into a gym station. Wait, wait, we're not safe yet. Uh, what? Defense system is offline. On the way up, the ship's going to pass through a debris field thrown up from the planet crack. Will be ripped to pieces unless you restart it. 
God damn it! I'll start working on it from here. Isaac, meet me at the bridge. You can do more good here than I can. Oh. Isaac, where are you? It's me, Nicole. The fuck? Nicole? So now she decides to show up, huh? Uh, I probably shouldn't go through there. I do believe we are getting close to- whoa. I'm pretty sure that we are close to being finished. I certainly hope so because, ugh. I know what's coming up and I am not a fan of it. Oh, I am not a fan of it at all. But I think that is in the next chapter. I do believe we are getting close to being finished here. Oh, yes, we are because we have officially made it back to the tram, which means that we are finally going to cut off as we make our way to the bridge. Just what exactly was the deal with that one room, though? What the hell was all the, with all the growth in the walls? Why were there people attached to the growth in the walls? Will we be able to stop the, the, the Ishimura from getting pummeled by floating asteroids? And what other dark secrets lie in wait? There is only one way to find out, and that is to tune into the next chilling episode of Let's Play Dead Space. Till then, take care.